Hello everybody, welcome to the shop. Quick little uh, video, question video for you guys today. Um, I found this very interesting piece. Uh, apparently it's an uh, inlet to a, a water pump or a well pump, and it's basically a restrictor is how it was explained to me. But it's uh, very interesting. Obviously this threads into the uh, inlet of the pump, I guess. But if you look in here, you have a small hole and it's uh, nicely radiused. Look on the other side, it's much larger. And it's tapered down to that hole. So what we have here is a Venturi. And quite a nicely made one. All heavy, solid brass. Venturis are pretty cool for uh, those of you out there who haven't uh, taken some physics classes maybe, or I don't know, most of us gearheads understand a Venturi. It's, the, it's basically how a carburetor works. But anyway, the way it works, if you have a fluid going in to a pipe, large diameter, with a given velocity, as that flow, that flow is constant, as that flow is choked down to the narrower part of the Venturi, due to uh, Bernoulli's law, Bernoulli's equation, I can't repeat it to you because I learned that in college, and that was, uh, oh, that was going on 10 years ago at this point. Um, as the cross-sectional area decreases, the velocity has to increase, and because of that, the pressure decreases. So there's actually a vacuum, or not a vacuum, but an area of lower pressure at the narrow part than there is at the wide part. And if this was a carburetor, that's where the fuel needle would be, and that vacuum or that lower pressure area would suck fuel and atomize it into the stream of, of air into the engine. But anyway, of course, this isn't a carburetor, but it's uh, very similar. It's really neat. I grabbed it because, well, because of that, and I feel like there's something cool I can do with this. But I just don't know what. So, all you science guys and science experiment guys, leave a comment down below if there's something neat I can do with this. Um, I would imagine I would have to figure out where the uh, narrowest point is, drill it and tap it, so I could inject something in there. I don't know. I don't really know what. But, I don't know. Leave a comment. Come up with an idea of what I can do with this neat thing. Uh, I don't know what these threads are, but I'm sure I can make something to mate on it if I need to, or I can machine this and put something else on it. Braze it, solder it, machine it. I don't know. Let me know. And uh, if we come up with a good idea, I'll make some videos of me making whatever contraption uh, we might come up with for this. So anyway, thanks for watching everybody. Remember to leave a comment down below. And uh, thanks for watching. And as always, come on back for more. And if you want to see what happens with this, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the like button, of course. Thanks for watching everybody. Stay tuned for more.